Restorex is the next generation penile traction therapy device developed by Pathrite Medical in cooperation with Mayo Clinic. It is easy to use in two simple steps, secure and extend. Before starting, take a moment to familiarize yourself with Restorex. The pelvic ring comfortably fits against the body and holds the extension rods. Later, you will learn how to select the correct length extension rod for your anatomy and how to place the rods on the pelvic ring. The functional buttons are colored blue and are used to secure the clamp and release the extension rods. The rotation buttons on the Restorex are not used when treating for lengthening only. The spring-loaded tension rods provide the resistance to achieve traction. The white band on each tension rod tells you when you have achieved the minimum tension level. Let's complete the one-time setup of the Restorex device. To do so, you need to obtain your stretched penile length in order to choose the appropriate extension rods. Ensure that the ruler measures the full length of your flaccid penis by pushing the end of the ruler into the fat pad located at the base of the penis. The Restorex device comes with the standard rods assembled. And for penile lengths greater than 6.25 inches or 16 centimeters, the extended rods are in the Restorex box. If the extended rods are needed, remove the standard rods by unscrewing them and then attach the extended rods to the pelvic ring as shown. It is recommended to use the enclosed self-adherent wrap to improve comfort. Wrap the penis two to three times as shown. Do not over tighten, however. If worn too tightly, it can restrict blood flow to the penis. Now to complete the setup, push the clamp release tab and remove the clamp from the housing. After opening, place your wrapped penis in it as shown. If you cannot close the clamp to the second click or with it closed, you do not believe you can comfortably wear it for 30 minutes. Adjust the height as shown. Let's use Restorex. Begin with Restorex pulled all the way back toward the pelvic ring on both the extension rods and tension rods. Place your penis through the pelvic ring and onto the open clamp. Slowly and gently close the clamp. Continue to close until it's tight enough to be secure, but at the same time can be worn comfortably for 30 minutes. Second, as shown, pull Restorex back on the tension rods to release the lock and then slowly and gently release the springs. Next, while holding the pelvic ring against your body with one hand, lengthen Restorex by pushing it along the extension rods one notch at a time until the white bands on each tension rod can no longer be seen. Many men have found a second method of extending and adding tension to be easier, particularly those that have difficulty with the head of their penis slipping out of the clamp. First, advance the Restorex device along the extension rods until the penis is nearly fully stretched. Next, slowly and carefully release the tension rods as shown. Most often, the white bands will not appear. If they do, relock the tension rods, advance one more notch on the extension rods, and release the lock on the tension rods once again. Repeat until the white bands do not show. After a couple of minutes, tissue will begin to stretch and the treatment zone band may reappear. If so, advance one or more notches on the extension rod to stay in the traction zone. If you can comfortably tolerate more traction, continue advancing. The following chart contains the recommended treatment times for Restorex. Start slowly during the first week of use, working your way up to two 30-minute treatments per day. Remember to always separate the two treatments by at least 30 minutes. At the end of the treatment time, simply open the clamp, remove Restorex, and remove the self-adherent wrap if used. Remember to always store with the springs untensioned. Read the instructions completely prior to use. Use only as directed and advised by your physician.